Hey Libra, it's your girl Tarot Card Bay, and I'm here to do your reading for January. I hope all is well. If you're interested in a personal reading, you can check out the description. If you like this video, make sure you like it below. And if you haven't subscribed, feel free to join our tribe here. All right. So Gemini, before um, I start your reading during the pre-shuffle, I got this no more Mr. Nice guy no more mr nice girl <laughs> no more um no more lover girl kind of energy so you might be really blunt right now i think you're leaning really heavily into your logic and not your emotion you're coming out of a fantasy so that's what i got for you all right so let's jump in overall energy for libra we got king of wands the devil hmm and temperance here yeah I definitely feel like you're more in control than you used to be specifically when it comes to like your emotions in the past if you waited for someone if you yeah you really worked on making other people happy waiting hoping someone's gonna reciprocate love and emotion and power you're kind of just accepting that for yourself like you're trying to become the lover that you seek here and be in your power. Now this devil, I kind of feel like this is energy that you left behind you, but let's clarify why is this devil here? We got six of pentacles. Why is this devil here? Two of swords. Six of cups here. I think you're blocking people from the past. I'm really getting. I get that you get trapped in the past, Libra. You might even over fantasize um, the stuff that happened in the past, like make it better than it was, make partners more loving than they were, give more significance to situations that are actually there. I feel like you're blocking this. You could be blocking anyone coming from the past. You're really working on being in present energy. Yeah. Nine of pentacles. Yeah. You're working on you. You're working on your healing. Um, very much being in the present. Nine of Pentacles energy is pre-empress or pre-emperor energy in which this person is in the present. She's looking at the bird on her arm. She's appreciating the things that are around her. She's She has growth and abundance around her. She's not looking into the past for her abundance. She knows that it's all around her. All right, what about the person who's on your mind, Libra? The person who is on your mind, we got nine of wands yeah this kind of continues the energy of you being guarded or this person being guarded from you let's see nine of cups for this person who's on your mind six of wands here why is the nine of wands here page of swords so this person is guarded the person who is on your mind but they watch you for sure you make them happy watching you makes them happy they might be watching you be victorious overall, watching you in your power, but there's something about this that makes you happy. Let's clarify this nine of cups energy could be dealing with a Pisces. We got high priestess energy and the three of wands. This person thinks they're coming back at some point. Like they don't feel like this cycle is over. Intuition is telling them that, that it's not. Um, and that they're kind of getting this intuitive nudge to come back. But I'm also getting really strongly. They just think that this is not over. I'm kind of getting some arrogance here. Look at this. this the world card for a cycle. Um, so yeah. They think this is just a resolving, revolving cycle with you and this person. Get some arrogance for this person as well. Ace of Pentacles energy. Kind of feel like if they come to you and offer, they know you're going to take it almost. Like they know you want to be with them. Page of Wands. You could have communicated love to them or passion to them in the recent energy. And they know that if they offered you commitment that you would go for it. How do you see this person? Taking too long with the Seven of Pentacles. The Fool card. Ten of Wands here. Yeah, you feel like this person is a little bit too carefree. Like they don't take you serious, Libra. This could be vice versa, but it's almost like they're just living their life, not thinking about you. This is how you see them and you feel like they're taking too long. King of Swords energy. I feel like by the time this person comes forward, you might block them. We got 
nine knight of cups here with the lovers the love energy here yeah i feel like there's gonna be a block empress energy king of pentacles so there could be a lot of people involved in this connection this person could be engaged or have something going on with a the child they could just want growth with you they could want to be a husband but i also get it's a possibility that there's multiple people here you could have blocked this person out because of a commitment or something involving another person here this person is coming in they're leaving behind the burdens and they will come towards you they want to start a life with you all right, what about outcome in the next month between you and this person? Five of Cups. Why is the Five of Cups here? Knight of Wands. The Star card. And the Three of Pentacles. I feel like if this person comes in anytime soon, you're going to deny them. Or you're just going to want to take things slow. This could make the person feel rejected. Um, they're going to come in fast. You're going to slow them down. And this might make this person feel rejected. Um, you are open to collaboration after a certain point of time where there's healing here. This person could be at a distance also. All right. What about Libras who are single? What's going on with our single Libras? Single Libras, what's going on with you in this current energy and for January? Queen of Swords, similar energy, blocking people out. Also using your wisdom here. You're looking at things from the past um, and you're really reevaluating your next steps. You're even being a little bit hard on yourself for like things you could have been done better not being a victim mentality not sh like not blaming other people for what happened really right really taking account of how you contributed to your own pain and trying to find wisdom in that hanged man energy why is the hanged man here ace of pentacles three of wands and the Ace of Swords. So you could be wanting to relocate. I kind of get this energy of wanting a new start or at least just planning your next steps. You've been enlightened about something. I'm not sure if this is something about yourself singles or something about another person. Yeah, Ten of Swords. Five of Cups here. I think you know or you've been enlightened that any endings had to happen. Um and your urge to focus on you, focus on your own cup, focus on self-love here. The truth is in the endings needed to happen. Any endings needed to happen. So you can focus on yourself. You're being redirected to self. All right. What about the person's on your mind or the person who's coming towards you for our single Libras, the person coming towards you? Temperance is another sign of healing. Could be dealing with the Sagittarius energy. Four of pentacles why is this person afraid page sorry knight of knight of swords this person who is coming towards you is actually going through some healing energy there's a bit of a fear for them to reach out to you maybe because of sharp words that you said to them in the past they don't want to get their feelings hurt six of cups here yeah they think about the past the moon this person misses you libra they just don't communicate that to you two of wands they are in the energy of deciding if they're going to come forward in the will of fortune here why is the will of fortune here will of fortune we got the two of pentacles and the knight of cups so yeah i do see this person will choose you and come forward singles all right, what about an outcome for the next month with you and this person? We got the Emperor here and the Queen of Wands and the Lovers. You could be dealing with the Aries, by the way. Um, I do see this person like sees you as someone who can always get things done. They see you as almost like this magical creature, this person who is really into creation energy. You see them as this emperor type of energy, somebody who's in control, somebody who's a boss, somebody who can get things done. Like you met, like there's some admiration that you have for each other because of this energy. Like you imagine being with each other. I'm getting, yeah, there's some anxiety though. And some depression about the past. All right. 
the sun card. I definitely see this possibly being very positive with you and this person, Libra. For Libra singles. All right, if you're a Libra single and you did not get a message from either of those messages, I'm going to break it down by element. Libras. Libra's dealing with earth signs. High priestess here. So if you're dealing with an earth sign, this person is really quiet right now. They're really going inside of themselves. They're using their intuition, really leaning on spirituality. This person may not be speaking to you. Um, king of coins, they do want commitment. They're also just focusing on their wealth right now. Uh, they do want commitment, but this person's actually manifesting you to them, Libra. All right, Libra's dealing with air signs. Single Libra is dealing with air signs. Page of Wands. This air sign is reaching out to you in passion. I get more flirty energy. Like this person might be just about the chemistry and the passion, not really the stability. This is something like this is somebody who you can have fun with. If you don't want something serious, this is a good option for that. If you do want something serious, then hmm. let's see. We got four of wands here and we got the world card. This could develop into something serious with this air sign Libra if you give it time. It's going to start off flirtatious, but it has the potential for marriage here. All right, Libras. Libras, if you are dealing with fire signs, Libras dealing with fire signs. Got the justice wanted to come out. Libra's dealing with fire signs. We got seven of coins. This fire sign is taking their time. Four of coins and the wheel of fortune here. If this is a fire sign from the past single Libras. They're taking too long for sure. They're taking way too long. There is fear here. I feel like there's going to be a change, either like a change by karma, a change that they make. Something's going to change that is divine. It's going to bring this person towards you. Look, the lovers. So yeah, if you're dealing with a fire sign, there will be a change and this person will come towards you. All right. What about Libra's dealing with water signs? Libra's dealing with water signs. We've got the eight of swords here. This water sign is stuck in their head about you. They're having some anxiety. Yeah, look at that. Ten of wands for the burden. Three of swords for the heartbreak. Yeah, they are hurt based on how this is ending. This has been a common theme for uh, water signs. A lot of the water sign portions, like they're getting over heartbreak when it comes to you. Yeah, temperance, healing, temperance came out again, and <laughs> ace of swords here, and the sun card. I feel like you're healing from this, this situation with the water sign. Um, you've seen the truth about this situation, and you're working on getting your own happiness, but this person is really dealing with the karma and the repercussions of their actions. They're really feeling the loss of you, Libra. All right, that's what I have for you, Libra. If you like this, make sure you like this. Remember, a like helps with the overall vibe. Feel free to subscribe to my channel. If you're interested in a personal reading, which a lot of you have been, they've been booming lately, um, my website is in the description. If you just want to say, hey, hit me up on Instagram or email me at Tarot Carpe. I love y'all. Have a good day.